Climate activists have vandalized the Louvre Museum by throwing orange paint over its iconic glass pyramid as they demanded a nationwide plan for the thermal insulation of buildings from the French government. 기후 활동가들이 프랑스 정부의 건물 단열 시스템 마련을 위한 국가 차원의 대책을 촉구하며 루브르 박물관의 상징인 유리 피라미드에 주황색 페인트를 뿌리는 시위를 벌였습니다. Okay. Well, first of all, it's very eye-catching, but I don't know if it's for the right reasons. Exactly. Tell us what's going on. Yeah. Well, um, what they are actually trying to do is that they are making a statement, right? Mm. So um, the footage uh, was revealed on how uh, an activist or a protester is on top of the Louvre pyramid and Mm. he splashes all this orange paint and it scatters all across the structure, Um, you know. I'm very saddened by it because mm. um, you will know that it's a very beautiful monument. But um, the activists throw uh, threw balloons filled with paint on the glass uh, and metal structure as well. Mm. Um, this footage was uh, shared on X, which was formerly Twitter. Yeah. And um, it was a group of climate activists. They're actually demanding this nationwide plan for thermal insulation mm. of buildings from uh, the French government. Um, mind you, France was actually rebuilt on the French Revolution, so it's uh, quite common for a lot of uh, this activism and sit-ins or um, kind of uh, revolutions or activists uh, being and, yeah. protesting across the city. Um, but this was actually a very blatant expression mm. on a piece of artwork. Exactly. 어, 건물의 에너지 효율을 높여달라. Yeah. 거기에 정부가 충분히 이어, 저기 노력을 지금 안 하고 있다라는 mm. 취지로 yeah. 어, 지금 이렇게 시위를 한 건데요. 로브르 박물관 입구에 보면 은 유리로 된 피라미드 mm. 사진으로도 뭐 직접 가신 분들도 많이 mm. 아실 겁니다. 거기에다가 이제 주황색 페인트를 이렇게 뿌려서 뭐 다른 건 몰라도 이걸 치우는 데는 또 많은 에너지를 써야 될것 같긴 합니다. I'm sure, yes. Mm. 자, 표현 볼게요. Yeah. Uh, vandalize something. Yes, if you vandalize something, you're actually ruining or uh, destroying um, uh, something that's actually public property. Mm. So uh, exactly what they did, the activists uh, threw orange paint. Mm-hmm. To get that off, you're going to have to use paint thinner. Yeah. And that's actually going to destroy the glass as well as the metal. And it's going to take a long time to mm. get off as well as a lot of energy. What's your example sentence? Um, the thieves broke all the windows and vandalized his car with spray paint. 네. Mm. Uh, 도둑이 창문을 다 깨고 그 다음에는 음, 스프레이 페인트를 mm. 차량에다가 다 뿌려가지고 이제 차량을 파손한 거죠. Mm-hmm. 공공기물 파손이라는 뜻이 있는데 그래서 어떤 물건을 파손했을 때 mm. 특히 건물을 보통 얘기를 많이 yes, 합니다. 여기서 이제 right. 차량 얘기하셨고요. Mm. 네, 그때 vandalize something이라고 합니다. Mm. 어, 공공기물 파손죄는 vandalism이 되겠죠. Yes. 자, 그 다음에는 thermal insulation. That's right. Um, if you talk about thermal insulation, it's more about um, padding. Uh, a building uh, so that it actually doesn't have to use a lot of energy, but it can keep you warm or cold uh, during the seasons when mm. it's uh, cold or uh, hot outside. 네, 단열 mm-hmm. 얘기를 할때 thermal이라고 얘기할 수도 있겠고 insulation도 쓸수 있는데 둘다 나와 있습니다. Thermal insulation이 mm-hmm. 되겠어요. 자, 그러면은 다시 한번 읽어보겠습니다. Climate activists have vandalized the Louvre Museum by throwing orange paint over its iconic glass pyramid as they demanded a nationwide plan for the thermal insulation of buildings from the French government. Now let's move on to the final headline.